Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for watching, thanks for tuning in. Uh, phantom braking, that is a pretty big problem with division only cars and even, believe it or not, and it's arguable, I know, but even the radar cars to some extent, but obviously not as much as the division based cars. So I did a video, a short video a little while back showing uh, phantom braking and um, I figured I'd do an update seeing we have a new update now. This latest firmware version is going to be 2022.4.5.4. So that's the latest one I know of. I mean, there are some newer ones like the beta and stuff like that, but this is probably the most popular no, uh, newest one. So let's take a look now. We're gonna do it in different conditions over the next few days, not just take one test here. And uh, of course, where I found phantom braking, not on a highway. Now, if you get it on a highway, I don't know what's going on. I've Since I've been over this vision only car, I've never gotten it on a highway. Where I seem to get it is just in a scenario like this, where it's two lanes, one lane one way, one lane the other way, undivided, where it's just separated by a painted line, as you can see this yellow painted line there, and um, you're on cruise control or or uh, basic autopilot, and uh, cars, there's not, nothing in front of you, there's just, you know, you, you can set your uh, speed limit, your cruise or, or even the autopilot speed limit to to the maximum or to whatever you want and there's nothing in front of you slowing you down so let's test it out as you can see right now it's a little foggy out I don't know if you can notice it up in the distance head so that's uh, gonna be one you know condition it's gonna be the fog and then uh, we'll test some other conditions out now also I sh should mention it's with big trucks uh, like big pickups and stuff like that or tractor trailers or dump trucks or cement trucks anything big so you know what well without further ado let's test it now i can see we are doing 80 as you can see in this in the uh, speed there and up ahead we have a truck coming so let's see what happens with this yellow truck it's a pretty big truck we're doing 80 and nothing it just maintained the speed perfectly okay dry roads uh, just a regular suv coming by us doing 90 and that was fine Really fine. Sometimes where it also happens is on these uh, on these hills. When you come up to a hill or a crest of a hill, uh, when you go around the hill or go over the hill, it heavily breaks. And as you can see, we went over that hill there, and it didn't break. Okay, we're doing 88. The pure later truck. I actually sped up there to 89. Okay, we're doing 90 kilometers. We have a big tractor trailer coming up ahead of us, right towards us. We'll see what happens. And nothing maintained 90 I'm quite happily surprised so far so good could they have actually fixed the phantom braking we'll see there's some more trucks here coming towards us doing 90 haven't slowed down at all as you can see we're still in autopilot if you, another truck we're doing good okay a few more tests with some uh, pickup trucks different size pickup trucks coming our way still maintaining 90 looking good uh, actually getting boring now I, I i think you know we may be in luck i don't know if tesla changed something fixed something or turned something back to how it was because when i first got this car oh did something there there was nothing around and it alerted and it went down to about 87 now it's picking back up to 90 so maybe that was one phantom braking uh, with no vehicles involved actually no crest of a hill nothing i don't know what that was i'll have to look back and see what Maybe it was something that I didn't see on the um, screen. Anyways, like I was saying, I don't know if they fixed something, they took something out that they had in, that they added in, and they just omitted it again because it used to work. I used to have this vision car working with no phantom braking when I first got it back in May of 2021. It worked flawlessly, so I'm not sure what's changed to uh, introduce the phantom braking, but um, it seems to be, other than that little hiccup there, so far, so good. Let's test some other conditions where it's um, different weather. Here's a big truck doing 65. No fan braking. No, it didn't do it. Cement truck. Totally fine, and that was uh, coming up to a crest of a hill too. Okay, folks, didn't want to make this video too long, so that's it. Like once again, this is 2022.4.5.4, .4 .4, one of the latest versions that I know of, and uh, 
it's night and day. I've got to say, for the vehicles at least, the, the big trucks and tractor trailers and pickups and stuff like that, it's night and day. I haven't had it, I've, you've seen about almost a dozen tests there, and it hasn't slammed on the brakes once. When it was slamming on the brakes, it was slamming on the brakes. See, now it's sort of slowed down for, it, it's still doing it for like hills, it seems, a little bit. But you saw that blue truck go by and this red one coming up? It doesn't hesitate at all. It doesn't hesitate, it just keeps going. Uh, and doesn't slow down at all. So they fix it in that sense. And, and when it did slow down at that crest there, it slowed down like very slowly, very, very moderately. It didn't slam on the brakes like what it was doing before. Before it was, I would have to say it, it was dangerous. And I complained about it before. It was very dangerous before. Now, with that little slowdown there, I wouldn't say that it's dangerous. I'd say it's moderate. I've got a guy behind me here. Um, and didn't interfere with him at all. I'd be curious to know that if um, the actual brake lights had came on when it slowed down that five kilometers so slowly. So that's it, folks. Let me know down in the comments below if you're on the same version in the same situation and you're getting uh, phantom braking. Like, I'd be very, very curious to know if you're getting phantom braking and what you're doing differently than I am. Like, in the, like I said, in the same scenario with the same software, if you're getting it, let me know down below and uh, we'll discuss it further. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.